Hey y'all, so I have literally cleaned the entire house. I did put some clothes on. Today's actually Wednesday, but it is Shedrick's birthday weekend coming up. So I'm trying to hold off on like washing my hair and doing it for like the birthday festivities and stuff like that. But Bath and Body Works has their concentrated room sprays for $3.25. And that's one of like our favorite things to get from Bath and Body Works. So I'm about to go there now and grab a few. Girl, it is a freaking ghost town at Bath and Body Works. Like, nobody is parked up here. Ah! I'm about to run in here and grab these room sprays. I'm gonna take this off though. I really don't know how well my hair has laid down because I literally just put it on. Mm, it's still kind of sticking up, but it's better than what it was. Girl, we got the goods. I'm gonna do a haul when we get home, but I just want to hop on here and say like, Misery loves freaking company. So it was two cashiers and, yes sir. What year Jeep is that? I'm sorry. What year Jeep is that? It's a 2019. 219? Yes. So I'm, I'm gonna get me one. Yes, sir. And I've been debating and debating. I yeah. like them every, and I love it when you put it in there. Oh, thank you. I love you it. Like it. I love it. You love it. Okay, yes. Baby. A 2019. Yes, sir. Okay, thank you. You get you one now. Oh, yeah, I am. Okay, I'm, all right. Have a great day. Okay, Happy holidays. Same now. <laughs> hey. He said he better get him a 2019 Jeep Wrangler. I was like, gonna get you one, sir. Yes, sir. Get you one. <laughs> I was saying how like misery loves freaking company because there was two cashiers, right? It was two men checking out and it was one lady in front of me. They were taking a long time checking them out. So it looked like one of them was doing like transfers. Like he tried to do the transaction and he was like, oh my God, you know what? I need to do a transfer. I like my card or whatever it was. And then the other guy, he was getting something for his lady and the reason why i know that is because he had kind of started conversation with me and then he's like oh you know you know what the lady like don't you i said i know what i like and so he was like yeah i'm just in here trying to find something you're gonna be in and out ain't you i said yes sir so anyway he's an older guy he was checking out so that's how i kind of knew i kind of pieced it together and so the cashier was telling him that he can get like the cellophane bags. I don't know, like the little clear bags or whatever. And so he was like, well, can you do it up for me? So she had already put everything in the actual Bath and Body Works bag. So she was really sweet. She took it out and she was putting it in there. She was gonna tie it up for him and everything. So the lady that was in front of me, she just kept looking around. She kept, you know, you know how you be looking to try to feel how other people feeling? Like she was looking back at me. So the first time I smiled and she kind of smiled back. And then the second time, she looking around and they were playing like a Christmas song. So I'm just, I'm just as happy and highly and jolly as I want to be. So she turned around, I'm just bebopping to the music. And then girl, the third time she rolled around, she was like, wow, it's kind of taking a while, isn't it? And I knew girl, when I tell you, I knew she wanted to say something. I, like, I, I hadn't even noticed the music is so good in here. Then let me tell y'all why it's good to be positive. And she was like, oh yeah, the, uh, this is a good song. I like this song. Baby, you bring them where you at. Do you hear me? You don't go down with them. You bring you bring them where you bring them where you are at. Okay? You stay, you stay high. And I ain't gonna lie, yes, it was taking a while. It it was a little slower than usual, but I'm chilling. And I want them to be like, girl, yeah, like, oh my gosh, I need to hurry up. Cause what is that gonna do? I mean, the guy's still gonna make his transfer. <laughs> and the other lady is still gonna wrap the gifts up for the other customer so what can we do what what is complaining gonna do so i just wanted to share that i'm in such an amazing mood you guys so we always do like highlights of the day and honestly you guys i think that old man dreaming and saying like how he's gonna get him a jeep one day was like the highlight of my day so far but i want to share with y'all what i picked up i got winter pair forest and then i got a laundry day white tea sage and i was telling y'all when i did the candle haul that i should have gotten a candle with fresh balsam but i got the room spray instead this luminous i didn't like this as a lotion but i think i would like this as a room spray also picked up two all a good night getting linen and lavender in this weekend which is like an og that is like really really good <laughs>
beautiful thing about life is that you can literally just decide that you align or that you identify as a certain thing and you can literally do it. So I've decided that I'm a runner girly now. We're about to go on our first run. Girl, I don't know what I'm in for. I just woke up one day and said, I want to be a runner. I want to be a runner girly. I'm in my running era. So let's see how long this lasts. <laughs> Okay guys, so we just got started. It's the day after Christmas. And I just was just like, girl, we're gonna run. I ran track in like middle school and then I also ran track for like two seconds in high school. And I just wanna see like how long I can go without stopping because clearly your girl is out of breath. And what sparked this was because I be out of breath too easily like I can walk up like three stairs and I'm freaking windy. I don't like that. I don't like how this is boppity boppity. Keep going. Y'all, we just hit half a mile. 6.55 minutes. Oh, I didn't put my on. You don't have your watch on? I got my watch. Epic fail. But I'm, oh. I'm... oh, God. I feel like I do have a history of asthma, but okay. my husband tell me don't say that because We've been together for 13 years and he's never seen me with an inhaler. All right, so clearly I'm tired. I did half a mile. I did half a mile in seven minutes. And I feel just winded, but I'm proud of myself. Um, do you guys, we're literally like racing out of the door i have on this um jacket that i got from rue 21 years ago this bodysuit from shein parmone socks harachi um sneakers some things never change and y'all know i have on my z little glasses hubby has on second look because we support april b around these parks period his nike joggers and his jordans so super cute the fit. Hey, what is up everyone? I'm Valerie Crab. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I would love to have you part of the family here on YouTube. I hope you guys had a very Merry Christmas. It is and a Happy New Year. <laughs> yeah. It is December 26th. Our Christmas was amazing. Um, you guys saw me breaking it down at the beginning of this vlog, and now we're doing the next day shopping so our first stop is going to be target which i already know what i'm running in here for but i mean it's target so of course your girl gonna do a little looky look or whatever and then we want to go to the mall and then i want to go to the beauty supply store it's just a, it's just quite a bit so i'm bringing you guys along with me i miss you guys so 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 much and this is gonna be like probably a really long weekly vlog so i hope you guys are ready and along for this ride just want to come in and officially start the vlog and let's go to target usually i don't post usually i don't post but i want the world to know time to pull a drop top out summer nights it's a vibe yeah Okay, so the girl that work at Dick's, she recommended these, but like, I like these, but I didn't love how they feel. With the New Balance phone runners, when I put them on, I instantly felt like I was on cloud. So I think I'm gonna start with these. 
there's any runners um let me know if you have like what running shoes you recommend but we're starting off this is going to be my first pair and we'll see how it goes okay guys we have made it back home i'm going to show you really quickly what we have what we picked up so riley got money for christmas and she wanted to like spend her money and she's really into like these squishmallows so i saw this one i just so happened to come upon it and this is the Disney 100, that's why it's silver. And so this one is... It's Mickey. It's Mickey? Yes, it's Choo Choo Trade Mickey. Oh, I see, it's Mickey with it's the a, Mickey ears. It's Choo Choo Trade Mickey from like the original. So those are regular $24.99. She got it on clearance for $12.99. Shedrick picked up his nephew some bas a basketball and a football. All of us got loofahs because we wanted to make sure that like we you know, are pushing them out regularly. I bought a little bit more Christmas stuff this year. We didn't have any room for like the newer stuff. So we bought another tub. And I got red obviously because Christmas. I picked up this skin therapy cleansing oil and this is so that I can double cleanse because I've noticed that like when I wash my face and I'm like washing my face with my hydro boost which I absolutely love by Neutrogena and I'm like working it in working it in working it in for like you know at least 60 seconds okay I know the girlies say 90 to um, 120 seconds but I feel like 60 is like okay um However, I noticed that when I go in with my toner on my cleansing pad, there is still like a lot of dirt and makeup left on my face. So I started using coconut oil, which is probably why your girl got a couple breakouts now. Coconut oil and then go in with my cleanser because it just really breaks all of that dirt and makeup off. And when I was using my toner, when I did the two steps, I noticed that cotton pad, like pretty much no dirt on it. But um, like I said, I think it was breaking me out because I was just using like coconut cooking oil <laughs> i know this probably so bad so i was like let me try this this is like just like a cleansing oil so this would be my first step on the days that i like wear makeup or whatever i might use it period just in general at nighttime and then i'll go in with my neutrogena hydro boost you guys saw us go to dicks so um and y'all saw me going running earlier because your girl is a runner now okay so i did see these new balances and i'm not going to even lie y'all I absolutely love this colorway cushion like I just love how these feel however the price was a little bit more than I was anticipating because it didn't have a price on there but when we got up there these were like 164 and Shedrick was like don't worry about it like we can still get them but I'm just like girl I'm just a beginner and although I feel like I'm going to continue on this journey I was just like I feel like that's a bit much like for me to be running just like a mile maybe or two miles starting off now when i start getting into like i'm running five miles then maybe we'll invest in a better pair of shoes but right now i don't really feel like that is necessary so we'll probably be taking these back ended up going to academy as well and i picked up some Basics. and the reviews were like really really good on these for like hiking running walking blah 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 these are super lightweight they're not cushiony at all like the other ones i felt like i was walking and kind of like i was like in the store like this i feel like i was walking and running on clouds but with these these are just like they're just lightweight they're just lightweight so i don't know and i'm like dang with i ain't trying to have any injuries either these are regular like 74 they were on sale for like 52 or something like that and I was like, this is a little bit more responsible for, you know, somebody who's starting now, who's not a thousand percent committed yet, who only, <laughs> who ran half a mile today. Like, let's just ease our way up. But I don't know. We'll see. I also went to Shop Miss A. I never tried this lash glue, but I got this lash glue because it said it was latex free. Y'all know I had a breakout from the old latex formula glue that i was using so i'm gonna try this out and hopefully it does not do your girl bad and then i got these lashes which are the stellas and then i got these which are the natalia's
it y'all so i wanted to come in and show y'all what i got for christmas so for those of you who don't know uh shedra gave me this gift really really early which is the kindle so i got a kindle and i've been using it and i absolutely love it um i also wanted some accessories to go with it so i have like this page clicker so that i can just like literally lay up under the covers and i don't have to worry about like touching it to flip the pages um so basically you just do this and you stick it on here i'm gonna show y'all so basically you just have it like that and then you click it and the page changes the only bad thing is you can't go back so you can only go to you can only go forward on the pages which i mean whatever so i got that and then another accessory that i got is this gooseneck for the kindle so basically you can screw this to like your nightstand or the side of your bed table or whatever and then you put the kindle on there and that way you don't have to hold the kindle like this is like lazy girl uh <laughs> lazy girl reading but y'all when i'm under the covers and then like this is just like popped up the candle is here i have my little page clicker bloop, 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 girl i absolutely love it so these uh i got all of that my kindle bundle um i will have everything linked down below i have been having this candle since i think september or october maybe october since like october and i absolutely freaking love it oh let me tell you something if you don't do anything else girl get you a wish list this is my first year like having a wish list and i sent it to shedrick with like all the links and everything i sent it at the beginning of october and totally forgot about it so but when i opened this stuff i was like oh my gosh this is like on my list and it was like the coolest thing ever so i really think that i will be having wish lists moving forward because people ask me like what do you want for your birthday what do you want for this and that girl i'm just gonna send them the list with the link okay and it's gonna be that so i got this a bodysuit from shein the quality you guys it's like really thick has the zipper in the back so it's just like super sleek and i will have the try on portion to the side so you guys can see and then shedrick also got me this black bodysuit as well it's the same thing just in the color black and then i also got this um wide leg jumpsuit and i like that it's like wide leg so it's a little bit more grown, a little bit more sexy. And then I also have um, the jumpsuit that I have on now that I absolutely love. And I'll just have it popped up to the sides. Shedrick also picked me up some second look pajamas. So y'all know my girl April B has her own clothing brand. And these are her pajamas. So I did want the green ones because I just feel like the green is just... You can get away with it year round. I mean, the burgundy is really pretty burgundy. And I was kind of like, oh my gosh, this will be so cute for Christmas morning. But I'm glad I went with the green um, because I I can just, just wear this around the house without it feeling like too Christmassy, you know. And then that was the top. And it also comes with like this cami. It's a three-piece set. Okay, honey. And I will have that linked down below. I saw from Shedrick, which I was so shocked about because I like literally was watching this girl's vlog. And she was like talking about this item. And I was like, oh. I think I want one of those. It is the Osmo Pocket 3. All the girlies are raving about it. However, I think we're going to take it back only because all the videos that I see, the quality is like trash. Like, like when it shows them outside of the ones, it's like outside and direct sunlight. But I figure like this camera is for like when you're out at dinner or, you know, you're running in Target and things like that. And when I see this, the quality is just not that great. So... We're going to take it back, y'all, because I just don't feel that it's necessary. Um, so we took that back, and that's when y'all saw, like, the the running shoes. So we got the running shoes. And then also, um, I got something else that's coming from Amazon that we'll see later on this week. He also got me the Billie Eilish, y'all. This gold one, bomb. Smells so good. I don't know how I feel about the... Billy Eilish number two. Like, I feel like I like it, but I don't love it. Like, this, love. This, just kind of like, mm, it's okay, you know? He knew I liked the gold, but he just went on ahead and got, like, the two-pack. But if I want to take it back, I can take it back and get just, like, the big bottle of the gold, which I might do that. I might do that. Because I just don't know how I feel about the second one. I'm going to spray. I'm going to do, like, one more spray and see. But if not, 
we'll be taking it back and getting the big bottle of the gold. And then also from Shedrick, these shoes, these pointed pleather shoes with this y'all because i just needed a pointy mule to wear with like my wild leg jeans and things like that so i'm so excited that i got that then from my mommy my mommy got me this black pleather skirt that was on my wish list she reached out to shedrick and shedrick was like oh she got all this stuff on her wish list so my mom picked this up for me and then she also got me some shoes as well it's very similar to the ones i just showed you guys but these are more um like satin i would say material and then it's a sling back so and the heel is a little bit higher so just depending on the vibe um you really can't go wrong with like black classic pair of heels so my mom even though i know we're boy boycotting them right now but she had no idea um, she ended up letting me have, uh, I get, think she won this at work. It's like a Starbucks gift card for $5. And then Shania got me a Starbucks gift card as well. So they didn't know I was boycotting it right now. But, you know, I think, oh, Riley got me a candle. So Riley's school had like a little store where you can go around and like get gifts and stuff. And so she had been saving up her allowance and she got me her sister she got me shania shedrick and herself some stuff and this is what she got me which is like a cute little candle super thoughtful because you know i love candles and the scent is super faint but it smells really really good that's it you guys so that is my little christmas haul and we gotta get ready to go so i will holler at y'all later hi guys happy wednesday today is december 27th we are is it wednesday yes it is we're moving right along in the week i have some orders that i need to do y'all this office is a complete mess so before the new year and i know we're creeping up on it real quick i want to come in here and just like clean my office because y'all when i say it's a mess i'm trying to make sure like it's a freaking mess in here so i definitely want to get that cleaned up and like just kind of have a clear space and a clear office for the new year but for right now we got to get these orders out so i do have some orders that have came through I'm trying to see where i can put y'all that's not really gonna be exposing your girl for real i have orders from from both businesses that i just need to get out really quickly So, if you don't know, I do run two businesses. I have a self-improvement journal that helps you identify your highest self and how you can align with her and basically helps you bridge the back gap from your current reality to your highest self and it gives you like action steps. It has um, six months worth of weekly journal prompts, reflections, all the things, girl. It is an amazing journal. So if you're interested in that, be sure to use Crack Crew 15 for 15% off. I also have a water resistant jewelry brand where you can wear the jewelry in the pool, in the shower, girl, wherever. Good top notch quality jewelry. Um, and also, same thing. Crack Crew 15 will give you 15% off. I will have them both linked down below. So first up, we're going to do the orders for Bosch Official, which is my jewelry brand. And I, oh, we actually have four orders. So thank you, God. Thank you for the three. Thank you for the four. Thank you for the one. Thank you for the two. Okay. And then for myself Evolve, we have two orders. So let's just go through these really quickly. Honestly, you guys, how I'm feeling, I'm just really starting to get to the place of like where i'm not going to be procrastinating and waiting when it's like i know i want something done i just go ahead and do it because what else do i have planned today really nothing so i'm probably going to be cleaning this office today because it's a mess all right so we're going to do this order so this person has everyday hoops gold 40 mm and a lyric necklace so right here we have the 40 mm and then she ordered a lyric lyric anklet those are the necklaces lyric anklet so girl even though it is the winter time and it's cold in some places but girl you might be going on a little trippy trip to a hot climate and you want your you know ankles out your feet out you want to have a little something something on your ankles it is never too early or too late to order an anklet because 
summer is gonna roll back around again okay and you want to catch it for the low low so you can go ahead and get it now have it We have someone who ordered one journal and someone in California that ordered two journals. So we're gonna get those sent out. And what I like to do is put the name because it's project whoever you are, okay baby? Because we're gonna be working on ourselves. So uh, project whoever the name is. I'm checking emails and this is the stressful back end accountant needs information payments are due portion of running a business okay guys so that last clip I was looking a little stressed um, and you know it's just like the ebbs and flows of business I did kind of pull myself together a little bit I showered took my did my skincare and everything now I need to go to office depot because I need to get some paperwork signed and have it scanned and sent over to my accountant and we're gonna like a super tight deadline and you know I thought this week was going to be super relaxed and chill but you know you gotta take care of your business stay on top of your things so we're about to go get that paper printed off because my printer is hit or miss and i'm just not even about to add any more stress to myself i'd rather take the extra steps to just go to office depot get it printed out versus like trying to tussle with my printer because yeah no so anytime that you might have to go the extra mile but if it's going to be beneficial to your peace of mind girl take them extra steps <laughs> just take the extra steps okay hey y'all great morning it is december 28th thursday december 28th i really don't want to come on camera like this but girl relatability okay i just woke up and I made some coffee and I was like I did not tackle my office yesterday I want to go ahead and get it knocked out early it is 7 18 in the morning and I was just like yeah like let's go ahead and get this knocked out hopefully I'm done by like 9 30 10 um and it probably won't even take me that long it just looks like a lot so I'm gonna throw on a podcast in my ears and Run the B-roll. Takers and givers, I've been caught the ladder. But am I really a giver? If I don't give to myself, don't take care of my health. Care for everyone else. I usually give away my best, but get into this reset. Get into this reset. Get into this reset. Take us give us up and call the Get into this reset. Yeah. I'ma adjust my clock like day, like saving. I get so happy about clearing the shelf. The shelf is up here. But I'm about to restock it just because I want the boxes gone. But this was me before you. Ain't nothing to start over. Hold me on a new vibe. She blowing my high. Gotta recalibrate my sundial. Yeah. Reset. 
Okay, girl, it is currently 9.27 and I am at my stopping point. So I went through all of the drawers, the closet, everything is just pretty much cleared. Now, girl, this is a little embarrassing, but I have this whole big bag of like mail and things that I need to go through to shred, but I just don't have a bandwidth for that right now in this second, but I am going to make it a priority before the end of January. Chedric really came in and helped. We actually decluttered our linen closet as well. And yeah, I just feel so much better, so much lighter. This space is actually like clean when I come in here. I am debating on like getting rid of our plants because, well, maybe not this one. Like I feel like this one is okay, but the mama over here, I don't know y'all. I just don't really feel like she's in a thriving environment. I don't always come in this space. I don't always, you know, remember to water her. I don't want to move her anywhere else in the house. The windows are not always open. So I don't know, like, I really don't know what I'm gonna do about that, but um, I don't want to just throw her out either. You know, I've been having her since 2020. So, um, I don't know if you guys have any suggestions, let me know, but at the same time, it's kind of like if I no longer align, if we're not a good match, then I need to figure out a way to properly get rid of her. So, maybe I can gift it to someone who wants a plant or who's really good at like helping plants thrive and stuff like that. I really don't know, but that's it for right now, you guys. So, I am getting ready to run errands. Well, the entire family, we're about to run errands. I also need to record a sit down video either today or tomorrow but i'm like girl if i'm about to put this makeup on and stuff i might as well do it today but definitely need to go to the beauty supply store get a relaxer a couple other things just because i want to go into the new year looking good feeling fresh okay this is a whole prep for 2024 type of vlog honey okay we have broken down the christmas tree we have cleaned the office girl we're gonna get our life all the way together okay so i'm just going to do something super duper light girl my hair is really given it needs to be done i've been doing it weekly and it has been really working out for me so this will be this has actually been seven days since i've done my hair so i mean it does what it needs to do you know what i'm saying but it's just time so i'm gonna go ahead and put a relaxer on it like style it up really really good and stuff like that but one thing i miss about vlogs that i used to do and vlogs that i enjoy watching is that the girlies just sit down and talk like they're on facetime okay so girl we're on facetime right now i want to talk to y'all about like i literally took like this whole break from social media which has been um a two-week break typically i do go Okay, first of all, with YouTube, baby, listen, I will go to YouTube in a minute. However, the person that I identify with now, she is a consistent YouTuber, okay? This is her job, so she shows up. So, with that being said, um, after I say this bit, we no longer identify with past Val. We are only looking at present and future Val, okay? So, in the past, girl, I would ghost YouTube so quick won't even think about it and um it's just because i'd be feeling like girl like i'm popping okay i'm popping but uh i used to get in my head about youtube quite often if i'm being honest girl i absolutely love it so much and i had to be real with myself and look and i was like you really can't even be mad right now because you're not being consistent okay just because you show up for three weeks that's that's not long enough to prove to anybody even yourself that you have absolutely changed and so when i came back in october i was totally committed i was like i'm gonna do this 90 days woo, woo, woo. right but girl let me tell you something when god tell you to sit down <laughs> you had better listen so i literally was sitting down and i'm still doing it right like i'm not I'm going to go back until the beginning of the year and I believe that my green light is going to be January 1. It's a Monday. It's a fresh start. It's my favorite day of the work week. However, I do feel like if God is still telling me to sit down come January 1, 
we gonna still be sitting down like <laughs> it just is what it is but no honestly i really do feel like i am getting the green light to return in january that's the whole spiel for youtube i will come in i'll go out as i please very willy nilly and this past 90 well i would say not even 90 days because i stopped mid-december so i would say from october to mid-december was the most consistent i've been on youtube in a very long time and it showed it paid off and girl we back okay so look out for me every single wednesday for a sit down chit chat let's get our life together type of videos and then sundays are going to be vlogs where y'all can get a peek inside my life and i'm always going to be dropping gems okay period because that's another thing like i don't want to just be uploading content where it's like y'all are not getting anything out of it and that was like another thing that i had with uploading my vlogs i'm like what are y'all really getting out of this and all of the girls would be like oh my gosh valerie you know you're such an inspiration and i see how you talk to your husband and how you handle your day to day but like i feel like i need to like verbally be dropping gems <laughs> and so you know it may not even be like not necessarily on the scale of like the sit down videos but just a little bit like just how i said like girl if god tell you to sit down sit down like it's okay um like just like stuff like that you know so that's the whole deal with youtube now instagram girl so this year i feel like in 2023 we're still in but when y'all see this one being 2024 but y'all get it so in 2023 i would at the beginning i feel like the majority of the year i was taking the weekends off from posting but i would still do my own little personal scroll and i'll kind of check in here and there not as heavy as it was during the week but i was still like popping in and then i would post in stories and stuff monday through friday so my girl listen this detox I miss y'all so much. Oh my gosh, to be a part of my Instagram fam, I miss you so dang much. It's not even funny. Like, girl, I miss y'all. I have had a week of detoxing, which is cool. It's like seven days, right? And I have also had a week of just not posting. Like, I'm not feeling content. I don't feel like being present. I don't feel like I'm showing up in a way that's, you know, um, intentional, you know, so I just like, I'm just not going to post. And so I wouldn't post. However, I was still active on social media. Girl, it has been absolutely nothing. No posting, no DMs, no scrolling, nothing. And no posting here on YouTube. <sighs> I miss y'all. I miss y'all so much. Even my YouTube fan, like I miss my YouTube fan too. But however, I feel like I'm, I'm, I have a community here, but with YouTube, because I don't post often and even when i was consistent the the last quarter of the year i was uploading two days a week so essentially i was only in, interacting with y'all two days a week versus instagram like i show up there every single day like every single day and i talked to some of the girls over there every single day like we're in the dms we're chatting it up um i am definitely one of those in I'm definitely one of those people who like answers the DMs and interact and things like that. I really hope I'm in focus because I don't have my glasses on. But anyways, so I just really miss them. And yeah, so I felt called to um, take a break from social media to clear my head. And I'm not going to lie, y'all. I was like, God, like the algorithm is algorithming over here on YouTube. Like, you, like, am I hearing this correctly? Like, am I really supposed to be not posting YouTube during the time of like, I mean, ads are just out of this world. Like if you know anything about YouTube in the background, like AdSense goes crazy in fourth quarter, specifically in December, which the ad revenue be revenueing okay and so i'm like god am i hearing you correctly <laughs> and he's like yes daughter sit down so i sat down um and i just picked up the camera this week and yeah i've been enjoying vlogging i feel a little refreshed and stuff like that so i'm super excited okay guys so i am all dressed now and amazon came so i'm gonna show you guys what i got i was telling you that all right you guys so i was telling you how we took how i might take back the perfume so i did take back the billy eilish perfume the the billy eilish original in the number two i took that back and got a big bottle of the billy eilish as well as some good molecules 
dark skin correctors serum something like that i do think that stuff is working um but we'll talk about that a little bit later i also was telling you guys how um i love the gesture of shedrick getting the Os osmos pocket 3 camera for me however um the videos that i saw and stuff like that was like you have to do like a lot of color grading and the quality wasn't like the best and i just figured like girl we're gonna use what we have which is just canon g7x okay um and then as the channel grows I will reward myself with a camera that I absolutely truly want. So, with that being said, um, we took that bag and y'all saw that I got the A6 as well as something else. I told y'all something else was coming later this week. And it is here, so I want to show y'all what I got. And hopefully, yes, this is it. Alright, sir, the first thing... I love that I cleaned my office because I know where stuff is at now. Oh, somebody brought this bag. Ooh, Ooh baby. <laughs> Alright, so the first thing I got is this little stand. And you guys can probably start piecing it together. What's about to happen? Okay, so I got this stand. Other thing I got... Was. Dun, dun, dun. Ah! A microphone, you guys. You guys. Stop. Oh my gosh, it's so exciting. So, obviously, this is a microphone and this is the stand for the microphone and for one, I wanted to up the quality of the sit down videos. So, this was like an investment. I feel like instead of the Osmo Pocket um, 3, I could literally just use my Canon G7X. I could use my phone for the time being. I wanted to invest in the quality of my sit down videos. So, got this cam, uh, got this microphone. I cannot wait to hook it up and like play with it and stuff. But y'all know we're about to leave, so I'll have to dig into this a little bit later. Um, but also, by the time y'all see this, we have been announced on Instagram. Tasha and I are starting a podcast. Pew, 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 pew. I know, I know, girl. I don't even care. Add it to the lineup, okay? Add it to your lineup. Another set of besties are starting a podcast. If you've been here for a really long time, you guys already know that Tasha and I already kind of had like um, a community of women that we built that were like wives or inspiring wives and things like that. This time, it's gonna be a little bit different, okay? Still the same vibe, still the same girlies, you know, talking their stuff on the internet. Um, but it is going to be um, broader topics. It's really just gonna be more so us talking about things and just dropping the gems in our conversations. Yeah, so really excited about that. We're gonna be starting that. It's called Let Me Call My Bestie because we're gonna be calling y'all every single week okay so y'all get ready for that so i have to get a microphone for that so got that um but all in all i did want to upgrade the quality of the sit down videos anyway so got me a little two for one or whatever that's that girl we are about to go okay so before we leave here's the billy eilish uh i literally just took it out the wrapper so the one that we got before this was like a one point it was like a 1.7 so like that's like so bright. Let me turn it down just a little bit. Um, it was a one point fluid ounces, but it was two of them. And then this one is three points of four. So it's the big boy. Oh my gosh. So dang on sexy, y'all. This stuff smells so good. But I'm curious to see how long it lasts. I don't think it's a it's a eight-day parfum. It's a parfum, so it should last. But girl listen ah, so good so sexy this smell y'all this smells oh and it's so fresh look you gotta spray it a few times to get it out it's like a sweet warm vanilla mm. okay and then when i'm done with this i'll probably just keep her because this bottle is so sexy you can use it for like 
It's a little decor on top of some books or something. So cute. Maybe in the office. I can tell you my problems, meditating my silence. But I keep pushing my pen, rotating my stylus. Broken is feeling like seeing, not no breath, low dollar. Used to be left on red, now all the girls go holler. Now all the girls go follow. All the fake fans gon' pile up. I need peace to borrow, get that shit right back tomorrow. Somehow all the fans go bravo, smile so much to hide my sorrow. Stay the shaky in Verado. this a distraction? I don't know if it's like so official, if it's a dis distraction, but I definitely want it for our sit down video. Hey, what is up everyone? I'm Valerie Cray. Ah! No, I think I like it. I think I like it. Y'all, I just finished and I feel so good about this video. I don't know. I always have to see when I edit because I be feeling some type of way sometimes, but hey, babe. Can you hear me? I can hear you now. Um, can you ask them about my automatic start and stop? Please. I did. Oh, okay. They're going to look at it? Yeah, they said they're trying to get someone to look at it. Okay, and then... Oh, well, I think that was it. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Love you. Bye. Like, I don't know. I feel good. So, all in all, I think it's like uh, 30 minutes raw. Um, So, I should be able to get it down to... Oh, my gosh. My TV's about to turn off. I should be able to get it down to... 20 minutes 20 minutes i think 20 minutes are good for like sit down videos now they have easily became like one of my favorite videos to record because i get to like really pour into y'all i was kind of telling y'all about this earlier in the vlog like i'm able to like just pour into y'all and give like useful healthful information like i don't know it just feels so good like i feel like i'm walking in my purpose and stuff like that so um yeah it will it should have already been up so i will link it in the cards and also down below and Shedrick had went to get his oil changed at 9 30. Now he got he has gotten or now he's getting my oil changed. And my appointment was at 11 30. It's 11 38 now. And I still need to create a vision board sometime today. And I also, well, maybe not today, but like before the weekend is over i did have tomorrow for content day which is saturday but i was just in the mood i was like you know what let me go ahead and knock this video out now but i don't know if i want to do like any instagram reels content or anything like that i don't know what i'm doing over on instagram like i love my stories in the, in the interaction over there in stories or whatever but as far as like what i'm going to post on instagram and tiktok like girl i don't know and i also want to work out today Technically, I really want to go for a run. Like, I cannot believe that I'm, like, literally a runner girly. Like, girl, stop. Just stop, okay? Like, just, who, who is she? Who is she? Like, I wanted to go running yesterday, but my legs were a little tight. And I was like, mm, I don't want to overdo it. We don't want no injuries. You know what I'm saying? So, I was like, let me give it a break. But I am definitely going to be um, going running today. And I want to go get a new membership card. Let me tell y'all something. We weren't tracking our expenses, right? I know we started tracking our expenses and we started back tracking our expenses in, was it November? No, this in, in December this month, right? And tell me why Planet Fitness came out. And I was like, I don't think that's the name of Shedrick's gym. It was my gym from 2020. And y'all know the pandemic happened and I feel like they probably put a pause on stuff, but then maybe they didn't, I don't know. So we've been paying $10.83 every single month. Didn't even know. It's just, just, just being drafted out. And so Shedrick was like, oh, you need to cancel that. And I'm like, no, you know what? I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go. But I don't really want to go in there like, <laughs> I'm gonna go, but listen, when you know you say, but you, you finna come up with an excuse. It's about to be an excuse. So think about that girl when you start saying stuff or when people say, when people give you advice and then you like, yeah, but just know that after that, but is an excuse. But let me tell y'all my excuse. <laughs> I don't want to go in there right now. Like I, I don't mind getting my little membership card or whatever, because girl, it's gone. It's lost. It's, it's, it's thrown away because I thought the membership had ended. 
Uh, I thought they like canceled everybody. I don't know. It's weird. Cause saying it out loud, it's like, girl, you know them folks want their money. But anyways, uh, or maybe they have like an app that you can download. I don't even know what the process is now, but maybe just go and see the process. But anyways, all that to say that I don't want to go up there right, right now. Like during the first of the year type situation. Cause girl, everybody and their mom ain't gonna be in there. So I, they, I'm probably gonna start going like mid to late January. So, and I mean, we've been paying for it this whole time. If it gets to the point of like where I'm really not going, then like, okay. Cause although I do love running outside, it has been so cold and my nose be running, my lungs be super tight from like that wind and stuff. And so maybe I will appreciate running on a treadmill. I know it's not as therapeutic or whatever, but um, yeah, you know, I'm willing, I'm open to test it out and see. Plus they have a Stairmaster and girl, when I was on that Stairmaster, your girl's butt was sitting, okay? And I definitely want my butt to be sitting. 15, all right. So I wanted to talk to y'all about my Spotify rap. Cause I feel like, I feel like I've been showing y'all stuff and stuff, but um, honestly, like one of the best parts of vlogging is that I just get to sit down and talk to my girls or whatever. So y'all can just like have me up in the background. Y'all can interact with me in the comments, whatever, whatever. But I just really like this. But I wanted to go over my raps. I don't even know if they still even have, oh yeah, it's still up here. So I'm a Spotify girly, okay. I love me some Spotify. I listen to 19 different genres. This is my most listened to song. I peaked on March 22nd at 232 minutes. I wonder what was going on. No, sorry, March 26th. I wonder what was going on on March 26th for me to listen for 232 minutes. Like that's insane. And I was in the top 33% of listeners worldwide that day. I listened to 514 artists. Houseway. How did I listen to 514 artists this year? That is insane. I don't really think that's correct because what? Out of all 514, Beyonce was my top artist that I listened to, which is crazy because I don't even feel like I listened to her like that. Um, and it says I couldn't get enough of Cuff It, which yes, because Cuff It is just like such a feel good song. <laughs> Oh, it's so good. And then it says that I peaked listening to Beyonce in September, which makes sense because April and I went to go see her when she came to Dallas in September. So that makes sense. I don't know. Maybe that's what peaked her up to the top, but I don't really feel like I listened to her that much. Like, I enjoy Beyonce and I think she's like an amazing artist and girl the movie just has me super inspired and I cannot wait listen I cannot wait for it to start streaming because I'm going to just have it playing in the background all day because she just it's just such a motivation of like get to work but I'm top artist <laughs> I listened to podcasts. My number one podcast was the Wealthy Woman podcast. She did really good interviews this year. And yeah, I just really enjoyed her podcast. I also listened to She's So Blunt. And she was my top podcaster last year. But um, like she took like a major break this year and stuff like that. But anyways, please believe that next year my number one podcast is going to be Let Me Call My Bestie, okay? Because I'm going to listen to every episode that Tasha and I upload. And yeah, that's going to be number one for me, of course. So anyway, girls, that's, that's that. Let me know who your top artists were. Let me know any podcasts that you're listening to because I'm always on the lookout for something new to listen to. is later on in the day and we are about to go pick up a couple of Riley's friends and head to the jump house. We're gonna go to the jump for just an hour, get out of the house, let her connect with her friends. And um, I decided to take a break. I, I was going to stay and do like another video, record another video. But I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna go with my family and spend some time with them because that's really technically what I'm supposed to be doing anyway. I wasn't supposed to do content until tomorrow. So if I have to 
get redressed and everything is totally fine. All right, y'all, so I decided to come down here to Planet Fitness to go ahead and see what I can't see. <laughs> Show my email in there. Let's get an account. Did you do login or uh, I did create an account. Okay. To, okay, it says I already a member. Leak your membership. The barcode is going to be your phone number now. Okay. Oh, okay, we got it. All right, cool. Uh, Just I'll check, check in. in. All right, perfect. Thank you so much. It's uh, digital now, you know. They don't do that anymore. That's so 2020. Now I need to go pick up my prescription. I went to the doctor the other day and got some blood work done. My iron was low and my vitamin D was low. They prescribed me vitamin D because my levels are just apparently so low. And hopefully I will see an improvement when I go back to the doctor in March. A pickup for Valerie. And the date of birth? Thank you, have it ready. It's gonna be $8.93. Mind just verifying the address? Yes, it's... Any questions about this medication? No, ma'am. There you go. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Great morning, guys. It is Saturday, December 30th. So we are moving right along in the year, you guys. The year is almost over. I feel really, really good. About to do my skincare. I'm going in with my Hydra Boost. After that, I will be using the CeraVe Hydrating Toner. Good Molecules Discoloration Correcting Serum. Two more serums. Um, the Hyaluronic Serum by Dime and also the... Hyper Glow by Dime as well. The old school Pond moisturizer. And then of course, my favorite ever sunscreen, which is the Tula. And I'm actually almost out. So that's going to be the lineup. I just want to go ahead and share all of that with y'all before I got into talking to y'all. Okay, girls. So like I said, we're moving right along in the year and I feel really 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 good i'm just like in a really good headspace which i'm happy about because i was just like i don't know i was just kind of feeling like i didn't know what type of headspace i was in so we have a lot to do today basically do my hair like do all things hair which is going to take up a huge time i need to wash riley's hair today i want to clean my house like i just wanted to get be in order i feel like i've been cleaning up throughout this week but it's still not new year's ready you know what i'm saying like i want my house to be new year's ready um also i did i done my nails and they don't look bad like they look really good they're holding up um these press ons have been on for two and a half weeks and so i've been debating on if i want to like redo them or just keep these on because these kind of do look like you know new year's nails or whatever um, but the fact that they've been on for two and a half weeks, I'm kind of just like over them and I want something new and fresh. I'm also like, girl, let's just say that for the new year. I also need to take an everything shower because <laughs> it's, it's, it's out of control. Okay. It is getting out of control. Like I need to shave under my arm, shave my legs. It's getting, it's getting, it's getting kind of hectic. just have like a lot of things that I want to do before. 2024 just so i can really feel like i'm going into the new year prepared get ready to do my hair y'all see i missed all of these all my forehead because it's like oh look at this Will somebody come look at this they know i'm growing my hair out like if i grow it out i just want it to be like right here i do want to get braids in the summer i have decided that and even if like i keep my hair like this length um what i was thinking like when the summertime comes I'll get my braids and then I'll do like um maybe like a bomb undercut. Alright, I'm about to put my relaxer on. <laughs> So 
So Shedrick actually bought some beer stuff from this brand and they were having like a huge Black Friday sale. And when he did that, he got like a leave-in conditioner, a deep conditioner, shampoo and stuff like that. He said he was thinking of Riley and I. And I used this deep conditioner the other day or the last time I washed my hair. I did a relaxer. I'm going to let this sit for probably 45 minutes. It said at least 15. I'm gonna do 45 if not an hour. Girl, that everything shower was everything. I feel so good, refreshed. My nails are done. I'm so happy I did it. I have been thirsty to try these infamous um, TikTok nails. Tomorrow is New Year's Day. And by the time you guys see this video, it will be past New Year's. So I hope you had an amazing, safe New Year's Eve going into New Year's Day. And yeah, so this is going to be the end of the vlog. Thank you so much for hanging out with me this week. If you are new, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe if you haven't already. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!